In this video, I'll be showing you how to remove the exit option from the XBMC power off menu. So to go from this to this. That's ideal if you're going to be using XBMC as an appliance in that you're not going to be using the desktop for anything else. You're only using the XBMC desktop. So to do that, well, if you're sat in front of the XBMC device, or this is Linux based, I'll put the equivalent commands for Windows or the equivalent folder location, I mean. So it's in the hidden folder .xbmc, user data, and the file is advanced settings .xml. So if you don't already have this, you'll need to create it. So it needs the HTML tag, advanced settings at the top, the closed one at the bottom, and the option you need is show exit button false. Now another way of doing that is via SSH if you've enabled or installed SSH on the device. That's SSH. So for my system, I can just type in SSH xbplayer.tzd instead of 192.168, etc. etc. I seem to have been a long time since I've done any security updates. Never mind. CD home as the current user. Dot XBMC. Press tab to auto complete. User data. Now I've already got the advanced settings in here. But either way, you can type in nano advanced settings.xml. So once again, if you don't already have the file, you'll need to go and create it by typing the HTML tag at the top there, advanced settings, and the one at the bottom I've got, which is the closure for advanced settings. So the command. Show exit button, false, then close tag, show exit button, and that's it. Control X, exit, Y to save changes, and enter. Now because my XBMC system is already running, I won't see the changes immediately. I have to reboot and I'll see the next changes next time around. But that's how to remove the exit option from the power off menu in XBMC. So thanks for watching. See you later.